Hello everybody and welcome to Dragon Age Inquisition with Kogoroin! We have finally found the area. It took me a while to find this one because we tried going this way, nothing there. We tried going in this gap over here, it was just an exploring place. Then we ended up exploring the entire places and I saw this. This is the answer. Right in this corner. Like compared to everything else, you don't expect it to be here but it's right here. So we're going to just complete that, basically. We are done. Wait, wait, oh, there's another thing here. Yeah, awesome. Yeah, 10 out of 10. Oh, there's some notes around. Oh, is that the final bot? It's the final bottle! Yes! Okay. I'm happy. We completed the wine collection. I'm happy as a bean sprite right now. Oh. What the? Oh, hello. Oh, is this a big one? Oh, oopsies. Never mind, we'll just deal with them really quick. Right. I didn't realize that this was the... Okay, let's try and do this properly now. So we know the first one is not legit. Verisong built mountains to their father, locking away his great works. Okay, so that was... Um, let's read it anyway. So his great works... Worked together for a long time, side by side, each ruined half of their tag. Oof. Right. Werewolf. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, but each ruled differently. They argued. They hated words. Uh, brother, the duel. Uh, okay, so we need the final one. Where is that one? Over? Is this over here? So this must be the first one. And where one beaver fell, the other rised in blood accident alone. Ah, oh, okay. So that's... I think... That's this has got to be the first, right? So it's like monuments to their father, locking away his great work. Yeah, I think it's this one. Let's just take a lantern. So that's the first one, and then what was the uh, what was this one again? This was, uh, but each ruled differently and argued. Yeah, this is a. Uh... Oh darn it! I thought it was pretty. I thought I was pretty confident in that, but at least we know that's not the. Alright, so that was wrong as well. Oh, where's the... Oh, there's the last one. Jeez Louise, that's so much spirit damage. Alright, let's take the flame. Oh, what was that? Did I loot it? Oh, spirit. Okay. So, it's the first one's this way. It's not the opposite way. So, the... So, the first one is this one. Which is about the brothers joining up, I believe. So, this one maybe? Ow, crikey. Alright, so what's this one? And where one brother fell, his wrote. No, I don't think that's the correct one. Something's funny about you. Oh? Uh -oh. 
Yeah, you talk about Grave Wardens, the honor and sacrifice of Griffin. But you're still not convinced. Not oh? convinced? Yes, you know what I mean. And you know this because? I'm a people person. Yeah, I got the same feeling, Bull. I don't think he's telling the whole truth. Worked together for a time, but side by side, each ruled half a tag. Ah, that's the thing. Yeah. Yeah, so it was this one. Uh, I should have followed my gut instinct, but oh well, it's fine. But each ruled differently and argued in heated words of the brothers' duel. Yeah, that's the. This is it. And then we go for the final one, which is right over here. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Just read them properly and don't do what I did. Let's see what's in this one. We're going to waltz inside and pick up what's there. Yeah. Objecting? Nah. Better us than the Venatori. Think about what's missing in these tombs, though. What? I've got a theory. Let's find the last one. Oh. 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 Oh, is that? Oh, no. It's a double-bladed dagger. Oh, that's a shame. Um, okay. All these pieces of metal inside the tombs we found, they make up a key. Hmm. Another roundabout way of hiding one's key under the cornerstone. Hmm. All right. Let's um, go back here. Oh, for God's sake. Why is it so far away from literally anywhere? It's ridiculous. Okay. I'll, um... I'll travel there. We. <laughs> Why is this desert so big? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, we're nearby. We're nearer, at least. So let's go, marbles. Eight hours later. Okay, no joke, this travel takes like three minutes to get to. It's redonkulous, the distance between them. And then this is where the dragon was, we defeated it, but at least now we finally get the big treasure, maybe. And find out what the brothers did. So the brothers basically destroyed their own taig. Because of ja because they wanted to lead the tag differently. All right. Nice, nice door. Wow. Supreme Demon's Flying. Dagger and. Barrier damage. Oh, that might be good for me. So, take off. Never seen a room like this before. Is this what the Venatori were after? Probably. Good job. Earlier, you said something was missing from these tombs. Hmm. Pits, arrow traps, anything to stop us besides a door. They thought the guy buried here was so important no one would ever think of robbing him. Oh. I don't know people then. I know. It's downright Kunari. <laughs> Oh, goodness me. Right, we did it now. Um, any, We could go to here and gain a bunch of those things, but I'd rather go with all the skulls, honestly. And we're missing some because the, the one that we have is... Return to Skyhold or go to... No, we'll go to the thingy, Bob. Yeah, we'll, let's go see Hawk. Hawk! I'm going to see Hawk. Ah, oh, it is that place. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's go here first. So we can get the... We can get to the vendor, sell some stuff, and then basically talk to Hawk, get it done. Beauty incarnate. Okay, we're back. We changed up the group. We've got Blackwall... Uh, who was it? Blackwall, Varric, and... Dorian. Yeah. So... These are the people with the interesting interactions, and I really don't... Like, the thing is, Solus isn't my favourite character. He's alright, but he's just a bit non-passionate about things. He, he's alright, but he's just like, oh, yes, I'm here. Hello. 
It's a pleasure to meet you. Okay. What are you doing? Okay, it dismounted me randomly, but can you... Can you not? Okay, never mind. We're going by foot. <laughs> oh, hello. You found anything? I'm glad you made it, Inquisitor. Hmm. I fear they've already started the ritual. What? Blood magic, I'd wager. You can smell it. Or see the corpses. Right. You take point. I'll guard your backs. Okay. We don't get to see you fight. That's a bit disappointing. Oh, God. Wait! No! Ugh. Lord and Commander Clarell's orders were clear. This is wrong. Remember your oath. In war, victory. In peace, vigilance. Mm. In death. I'm sorry. Sacrifice. Oh, oh God's sake. Good. Now find it, just as I showed you. Crikey. And abiding the wardens. Inquisitor, what an unexpected pleasure. Lord Livius Eremond of Virantium, at your service. Ugh. You are no warden. But you are. The one Clarell let slip. And you found the Inquisitor and came to stop me. Shall we see how that goes? Yeah. I already got, let's see what this one says. Looks like you've already done some of my work for me. Oh. What, him? We simply needed I didn't mean that, but okay. Oh, were you hoping to garner sympathy? Maybe make the wardens feel a bit of remorse? Wardens, hands up. Yep, full time. Hands down. Corypheus has taken their mind. Precisely. They did this to themselves. You see, the calling had the wardens terrified. They looked everywhere for help. And then found you. Yes, and since it was my master who put the calling into their little heads, we in the Venatori were prepared. I went to Clarell full of sympathy, and together we came up with a plan. <sighs> Raise a demon army, march into the deep roads, and kill the old gods before they wake. Yeah, you tricked them. So you manipulated the wardens to build an army of demons for Corypheus. Just so. Sadly for the wardens, the binding ritual I taught their mages has a side effect. They are now my master's slaves. Precisely. This was a test. Once the rest of the Wardens complete the ritual, the army will conquer Adas. Nope. Yeah, what's in it for you? You, you really want to see the world fall to the Blight? What do you get out of this? The Elder One commands the Blight. He is not commanded by it, like the mindless Darkspawn. The Blight is not unstoppable or uncontrollable. It is simply a tool. You're a fool. Certainly a tool. Precisely. For me, while the Elder One rules from the Golden City, we, the Venatori, will be his god king. Oh, you're an idiot. So Corypheus influenced the Wardens and made them do this ritual. <laughs> made them? No. Everything you see here, the blood sacrifices to bind the demons, the Wardens did it of their own free will. True. Fear is a very good motivator, and they were very afraid. That's a lie. The Grey Wardens are heroes. They would never do this willingly. Um, the Grey Wardens care about nothing save stopping blood. Yeah, I'm they sorry, Blackwall. That's not. Have seen Clarell agonize over this decision. Burdens have come 
command, I suppose. Yeah, because she feels like she's got no other choice. Why kill the old gods? Why would the wardens try to kill the old gods? A blight happens when dark spawn find an old god and yeah. corrupt it into an archdemon. If someone fought through the deep roads and killed the old gods before they could be corrupted, poof. No blights. No more blights. Ever. The wardens sacrifice their lives and save the world. Although I fear history will remember them a little differently now. Why would Clorel risk using demons? Demons need no food, no rest, no healing. Mm. Once bound, they will never retreat, never question orders. They are the perfect army to fight through the deep roads. Mm. Or across all A. Now they are bound to my master. Yeah, let the Boldens go. The binding and surrender. I won't ask twice. Mm. No, you won't. Oh, geez, what? The elder one showed me how to deal with you. And you've been foolish enough to interfere again. <sighs> Goodness me. Understood. Hmm. Thank you for that information. When I bring him your head, his gratitude will be Thank you. Oh <laughs> I get fucked. Kill them. Why don't them escape? Yeah. Oh, hello. That went well. Not as well as we would have hoped. Through their ritual, the mages are slaves to Corypheus. Yeah. And the warden warriors? Sacrificed. Of course. It's not real blood magic until someone gets sacrificed. Could they? Oh, wow. Look at me. Oh. Uh, how could they do this? They've gone too far. They misled, yeah. Herman lied to the wardens. They were trying to prevent future blights. With blood magic and human sacrifice. Yeah, I know. The wardens were wrong, Orc. But they had their reasons. Yeah. All blood mages do. Everyone has a story they tell themselves to justify bad decisions. And it never matters. In the end, you are always alone with your actions. I believe I know where the Wardens are, Your Worship. Herriman fled in that direction. There's an abandoned Warden fortress that way. Right. Excellent work. That makes sense. Good thinking. The Warden and I will scout out Adamant and confirm that the other Wardens are there. We'll meet you back at Skyhold. All right. I can't believe we just let him walk away. He's like, kill them! And I'm like, um, what? I'm sorry, did we not just... Like, you went here, how did he... <laughs> let them go! Did he teleport by magic? That's the only way I can think of it. All right, let's get back to Skyhold. All right, Skyhold, Skyhold, let's get to Skyhold. Like, the thing is, we know deep down that the wardens are net such a are a necessary thing because without them we would get more we nobody be able to slay the archdemon however we also know there are other alternatives with like more again she had the blood ritual or the baby ritual wasn't it yeah so there is a way of doing it so there must be other ways surely like, this is the thing that, um, like, is slightly disturbing about this whole thing. Alright. Okay, let's, um. Let's get over here. Oh, uh, where are we going? Okay, are they in the hall? Uh, 
Oh, hello. I tracked that Venatory mage back to Adamant Fortress. Yeah. They're looking at assault options now in the war room. Ah, oh, right. You did well, Varric. The Inquisitor is just who we need. Ah, oh, it's, it's been great. Murderous wardens, archdemon attacks, <laughs> blood mages and crazy Templars. Just like home. I know how much you hate it, Lady Kirkwood. Hmm. This is the ass end of Thetis. You know they eat snails here. Still, I, I think I uh, I need to finish this out. If it weren't for me and Bartrand, none of this would have happened. So much for changing our lives. And that's what happens when you try to change things. Things change. Mm. You can't always control how. Yeah. I tracked the wardens oh. to Adamant Fortress Inquisitor. Okay. Your specialist. Okay. You take care of yourselves. Alright. Tell me what the details are of the siege. Here lies the abyss. Okay. 12 to 15. Easy peasy. The fortress has withstood countless darkspawn attacks without without falling. The Grey Warden defending its walls are legendary warriors. To, pre to prevent the Warden Commander to prevent the Warden Commander Karel from rising an army of demons, Inquisition forces will siege engines powerful enough to break the... Yeah, let's start. Adamant Fortress has stood against the Darkspawn since the time of the Second Blight. Precisely. Fortunately for us, that means it was built before the age of modern siege equipment. Mm. Good trebuchet will do major damage to those ancient walls. Thanks to our Lady Ambassador. Oh. Lady Cyril of Jadar was pleased to lend the Inquisition her sabots. Awesome. We've already delivered the trebuchets. That is the good news. Yes, but what about the demons? Um... None of that accounts for the warden summoning a giant demon army. That is the bad news. Yeah, I thought so. The Inquisition forces can breach the gate. But if the wardens already have their demons. I found records of Adamant's construction. There are choke points we can use to limit the field of battle. That's good. We may not be able to defeat them outright. But if we cut off reinforcements, we can carve you a path to Warden Commander Clorel. So our plan is to lay siege to a legendary fortress filled with demons? Mm. It'll be hard fought, no way around it. But we'll get that gate open. All right. It's also possible that some wardens may be sympathetic to our cause. Mm. The warriors may be willing to listen to reason, though I doubt they will turn against Clorel directly. The mages, however, are slaves to Corypheus. They will fight to the death. Precisely. We've got the siege engines and readied our forces, Inquisitor. Give the word. We march on adamant. All right, here we go. All right, we ready? Let's do this. We're invading adamant. Woo! Let's go. Right. So who are we taking? So obviously you, um, Varric, of course, and Sarah, maybe. Because I feel like having double, like having Dorian. Well, Dorian's cool. Let's go. Let's do this. Oh, I think I know who to take to the... Like, there, there's the ball, right? So I think I'm going to take Sarah there because she sounds interesting to be able to take there. But let's complete this. And let's save the Wardens, maybe. Maybe we can convince them. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh. Yes. Go, my soldiers.
Oof. Shield up. That's it. That's how you do it. Ah! That's gonna hurt. Three. I'm so sorry. Oh, here I am. Hello. God, it's dangerous going in here. All right, Inquisitor. You have your way in. Best make use of it. We'll keep the main host of demons occupied for as long as we can. Don't take risks, yeah. As long as you can. Yeah. I'll be fine. Just keep the men safe. We'll do what we have to, Inquisitor. Warden Stroud will guard your back. Hawk is with our soldiers on the battlements. She's assisting them until you arrive. Awesome. Oh. Demons. There's too much resistance on the walls. Our men on the ladders can't get a foothold. If you can clear out the enemies on the battlements, we'll cover your advance. All right. All right, Stroud, come on. Oh, I'm moving a rock. What's this? Yeah, this, the rocks are like, this is trebuchets. If it hated all wardens, we're not demanding your surrender. Just fall back and let us deal with Clarell. All right, my men will stay back. We want no part of this. Deal with Clarell as you must. Well said. I had hoped some of the wardens would listen to me. Hmm. Let's go. I'm glad Blackwall spoke up, because for some reason it bugged out when I was trying to talk. But we are going to save, just in case something like that happens again. But I'm glad that uh, Blackwall spoke up. He was like, do you think me and Stroud would really join them? Pathetic fools. We're joining the battlements. Stop this madness.
I hoped you liked the video, and if you did, press like, and also comment down below and subscribe and click that notification bell. Until next time, lovelies. Bye!